Hi, lovey. I can't believe the day is actually here. Ah. I hope you guys have had a great morning. I can't wait to see you at the altar. We are going to have the most amazing day with our family and friends. Thank you for being the most amazing man in my life, and I'm so excited to finally be your wife. Have a shot for the babies and to calm the nerves. See you there, hottie. Love, Sarah. My wife. <laughs> Sarah, I can't believe today is finally here. 1,073 days since I asked you to be my wife. <laughs> but it's here, we're doing this. I can't wait to see how incredible you look today and I'll forever remember how you look for the rest of our lives. I knew from the day that I biked to your house, probably the last time I was on a bike, <laughs> that you were special. We have grown so much together and I'm so proud of you and so proud to call you my wife. If you need anything to focus on when you're walking down the aisle, know that my eyes will be walked on you. I love you, my wonderful bride. Yours forever, Chris. And I remember that night after changing her diaper, she looked up at me and she was staring right at me and I looked at her and I said, Sarah, I don't know what's, what you're ever going to come of in, in the future. I'm not sure what's gonna hold, what the future holds for you. But I know for sure you're going to grow up to be the most successful young woman ever. And one day you're going to meet a great guy and you're going to have a beautiful wedding with all your friends and family here. And speaking about true love, this day would not be complete without mentioning my mom and dad, Kurt's Nana and Papa, Wayne and Sue. They passed away three days apart in November of 2020, and we know that they are here today with all of us sending their love. And Sarah, we want you to know, once Curtis loves something, he will never let it go. Yes. Yes, this is Curtis's first baby blanket. He would not let it go because he loved it so much. So please know, Sarah, that he will never, ever let you go. So Curtis, Sarah needs to always be the prettiest girl in the room. Sarah also needs to be the smartest girl in the room. She needs to always be correct, and she needs to always be in charge. <laughs> and Sarah, Curtis just needs TSN. On behalf of Curtis and Sarah, welcome and thank you for being here. They are delighted that you're here today to share in their joy during this wonderful moment of their lives. Today, we're not here to mark the start of a relationship. We're here to recognize a bond that already exists. Today, they will affirm this bond formally and publicly. However, this ceremony would be empty if they could not share it with their friends and family. We see it now, the story comes together. I knew I wouldn't be able to hold back the tears today, not because of your beautiful eyes or your room brightening smile or how breathtaking I knew you'd look in your wedding dress. It's because when I look at you, I know that you're my best friend, my adventure buddy, my rock, my teammate, and my true love. I wish I could say that I have never imagined standing up here with you today, but that would be a lie. I have felt a connection with you since our first few days of grade 11 English class. From then on, our relationship has blossomed from a simple friendship to a playful and loving and adventurous partnership. The passion that you have for the people that you care about is truly incomparable, and I promise to love and care for you and the people that you love with the same passion. But truly, you are the most selfless and compassionate person I have ever met. I am so excited to see where life takes us together, and I love you so much. Your 
sky stays this blue. And you never see the gray. I hope that love is always kind. And it never fades away. We love, we love you, you both. both. Congratulations. Congratulations. Woo! Today, your kiss is a promise. Curtis, you may kiss your bride. We've